Local hospitals have their guard up tonight after a man posing as a doctor is told to keep away. We begin with a CBS 4 News safety alert at 6. The man was issued a trespassing warning at Jackson Memorial Hospital. But he says the whole thing is a misunderstanding and he's talking about it tonight with our Joan Murray. In fact, Joan is live at JMH now with the story. Joan. Well, Jim, this man is accused of showing up at this hospital and several other hospitals in the area. Now, he tells me it is true that he has worn a doctor's outfit, but he says he has not played the role of a doctor and he has done nothing wrong. I'm handling it very well because I'm innocent. Wilvins Basil says he wasn't pretending to be a doctor when he wore a white lab coat like the one you see here with the University of Miami logo on the Jackson Hospital campus. They have no evidence of me working with their patient or working with their lab or anything. In a statement, Jackson Health System said they were working to identify a man who had been seen wearing an unofficial physician lab coat at several local hospitals. On Wednesday, they say he was spotted by our public safety staff on the Jackson campus. Police were notified. He was issued a cease and desist letter and trespass warning and reported to the Florida Department of Health. Basil claims he was here Wednesday, but it was for a meeting to talk about their concerns. If they had any proof of me working on their campuses, I think I would be in jail dealing with their patients. So they didn't have, you know, no proof of that. Basil says he has worked as a home health aide in the past, transporting patients and even providing hospice care. He's trying to straighten out some old legal trouble so he can become a physician's assistant. I just want my all my licenses to be certified and everything to be cleared. For now, he said he will steer clear of Jackson and UM. You know, it gets upsetting because what you go through, but you know, like they say, what don't kill you make you stronger. So it, it's just going to make me stronger. Basil tells me he's a father of four, and this has been hard on his family. He confirmed that he has gotten that cease and desist letter. He intends to follow it. He told me to the letter of the law and told me he won't be back here or at UM. You can be sure the hospital, though, will be watching. In Miami tonight, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.